Every day, thousands of IV lines are used in healthcare settings across Alberta. Just like a dirty needle, once an IV line has been used, it's contaminated. IV lines are single patient use. Reusing IV lines could lead to the transmission of serious bloodborne illnesses, such as hepatitis B, hepatitis C, and HIV. Even if you can't see blood in the line, blood and body fluid contamination is a very real possibility. A simple mistake by healthcare workers can have life-altering repercussions for the patient. It happens, but is entirely preventable by following some simple steps. Always ensure IV lines are labeled with the patient's name and one other identifier. Check this information against the patient's name and PHN. If they don't match, if there's missing information, or if there's not a label, then stop. Do not connect the IV line. This helps ensure the right patient gets the right line every time. When it comes to IV lines, when in doubt, throw it out. If an error does occur, and you think a patient has been exposed to another patient's blood or body fluids, tell your supervisor or the patient's medical team immediately. In some cases, the complex follow-up process must be initiated as soon as possible. For more information, contact your site's infection prevention and control team.